Okay guys, welcome back to Let's Play Thief Gold. Um, here on my channel, Looking Glass. So, we are going to be playing Strange Bedfellows right now. Um, I don't remember much about this level either. I remember bits about, I remembered bits about Escape, and I remembered actually quite a lot more than I thought about the Haunted Cathedral, or Return to the Cathedral. But this one, uh, I just don't remember, I remember the very beginning, but I don't remember much beyond that. So, let's just jump into it. I also, I'm hoping that the Maw of Chaos isn't too difficult. Because <laughs> um, I would like to finish up this Let's Play today and then just get all the rest of the episodes uploaded for you. And then I'll be doing a Thief Gold review. Um, and then I want to switch gears. I've been playing a lot of Thief fan missions. Uh, thief this, Thief that. Thief Gold kind of took a lot out of me because, like, you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of, like, the undead missions and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, I kind of, I mean, I don't want to just jump straight into Thief 2. If I do anything else with Thief, it'll probably be in a week or so. I'll start a Thief Deadly Shadows playthrough, which I really love that game. So that will be, and I haven't played that one in a very long time. So that's going to be pretty fun to check out again. So anyways, without further ado and without too much rambling, let's just get back into it. So here we are. Strange that there's a dead body here. Let's not go through the flies. They, I think they still hurt you regardless of what's going on here. It's not looking good, guys. It's, something's up. Something's not right. close. Okay, what's my new objective? Alright, let's go in for the front door. I'm not sure that's the best option, but I just want you guys to see. Hopefully I didn't spoil anything with that last screen there. I have a bad feeling about this. What is this, a Star War? What happened here? And where are all the Hammerites? kind of funny that Garrett starts the game just absolutely loathing the Hammerites and they're not given a they're not given a good image in the beginning of the game at least but then they sort of uh, as the story morphs you realize oh, they're not actually that bad um, I did like some of the, the Hammer sermons uh, well, the one I read on the screen I think it was at the beginning of this or not you know uh, shaping of the chisel and whatnot. oh I forgot how many we can ugh noisy floors this place have has I guess I'm gonna be using making a bunch of pin cushions out of these uh, whatever's waiting for me out here because there's a lot of arrows here Broadheads, I wonder. I wonder what awaits us. Nothing good, I'll wager. Damn. Looks like Constantine got here before me. Well, this is no good. This way or not, dude. That's a red spider. That looks pretty nasty. Nice. Let's go ahead and save. freaks out at the spider, that's what he freaked out at. Okay, well, at least I didn't know I didn't screw anything up. How many gas arrows did I get? Not enough. Maybe 
to try, since I have so many broadheads. I've had enough of this. Just die. Damn it! There we go. Holy shit. Okay, let's make a save. Strange bed fellas. Very nice. Okay. That should have taken care of a good chunk. What is the new objective? Don't kill any hammers. Destroy all of the insect beasts. Well, alrighty then. I guess Garrett. It's, it's not very woke of him. Just want to start committing genocide all of a sudden. I hope there's no ridiculous. Uh... Uh, mission objectives in the, the, the last mission of the game. Like I said, I just don't remember this one like taking very long at all time I played but I could be mistaken you know, I kind of want to see what's out in the, the courtyard here are there any monsters <gasps> okay I hear spiders and I hear more dudes they're probably on the first floor so I'm gonna make another hard save here Finding well. I hope this save finds you well. <laughs> oh god. Alright, so this it's cool that they still have the switches up. Oh god damn it. Thank you. Don't hit me with the sword, jerk. Somebody give me a health potion, please. Gotta zoom, gotta zoom, gotta zoom. Seriously, bro? save there because I've, I've killed so many now but that guy took out a lot of health it's not advisable to stay like this how was that Like, where did all the treasure go? I robbed them blind. That's where it went. How many health potions do I have? I think it's just one. Yeah, I'm so screwed. Once again, this seems to be sort of a combat focused mission. Which is a bit obnoxious, you know. Mortar cannot hold when the stone is not strong and clean. Before beginning thy endeavors, look to thy material, both physical and spiritual. I will remember to I will endeavor to and remember to do that, my my friend. Well that's not a spider, that's a frog beast. Thank you, frog beast. The 
unholy windows. Vile beasts. And the physics calculates that it should just launch you backward when you're trying to move forward. Lots of books to read, very nice. But I would really appreciate some fucking health potions. Please. I may have to reload that save. That I don't think that worked out too well for me. When I was cold, thou taught of hearth and roof beam. When I was hungry, thou taught of pot and cauldron. When I was beset by foes, thou taught of spear and shield. Thy hammer pounds the nail, holds the roof beam. Thy hammer strikes the iron, shapes the cauldron. Thy hammer in my hand unto my foes. Hammers are pretty dope. The builder gave thou the raw stuff of thy life. Make thou a great work of it, or thou mockest his gifts. A stroke of thy chisel once made cannot but a stroke. Oh, I already read that one. Last time we were here. Guard thy tongue from falsehood, and thou guardest thy purse from a jackblade. Guard thy hand from a misdeed, from misdeed, as thou guardest thy house from firelighters. When the builder walks before thee, and builds for thee a great fortress, wilt thou go inside and shut the door, or wilt thou say, Yes, and now I shall raise one of my own? Uh, I already read that one. When the builder came amongst his children and asked, Who is it that hath spoiled this work? Uh, I read that one. Read that one. Yep. The proof of the wall is that it stretcheth above the height of a man, and lazeth beyond the span of a man. Our greatest works exceed us in all ways. Hold on, is there? No, there's no extra pages here. Holds, hadst thy a hammer, wouldst thy hammer in the morning. Wouldst I hammer in the evening, all over this land. Hmm. Yeah, we read the one about the thief. O oh, Master Builder, we ask thee to bless our brother who hath... Oh, the prayer of consecrate. Oh, we already we read that at his... Uh, what's his face's? Burial. But, excuse me, sorry about that. Kind of just slipped out there. Did not mean to be so crass. Uh-oh, is there a dude here? Then did the Builder lay down his hammer and take his chisel to hand. Smoothed he the rough gem, and shaped it to his will. For each ta task hath its tool, and every tool a task. I, I think they want us to, like, uh, do a lot more archery in this one, which I probably should have done since I was up there and he couldn't... Whoop. What's in there? I'm really kind of rethinking if I may need to uh, load a save, because this is not... I may need to load a save, guys. This is not good. I lost all my health. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna go ahead. I think is it is it the quick save? Yeah, we're gonna load it. Sorry about that. Nope. Load. Finding. Yeah, it was finding well. I remember now. Okay. Let's. We know there's a shitload of arrows, and we can just keep sniping him for you know. Let's see who he brings. Well, let's try going down there now. Seeing if we can. Uh... <laughs> Screw you. Well, that worked out much better. Okay, I'm feeling confident now about making a save, checking it twice. Speaking of checking it twice. Alright, good. Checking the recording there.
if it wasn't clear. Who is this fucking spider? Where is he? Okay, so we can't get down through those caverns, that's fine. We checked in here. Did we get anything here? I don't remember. No. No, I don't think so. Okay. I wonder if it's implied that the sword in Thief 2 is Constantine's sword. Or if I forgot, maybe you have to like open a tomb or something with it in the last level. I don't remember. Also, I don't. I never understood what the significance of it being Constantine's sword is. I guess maybe it helps you defeat ghosts. Maybe that's the explanation for how you can defeat ghosts. But for some reason, not zombies. No, no, we wouldn't want to make things too easy, now would we? All right, there's a fucking spider around here. I think he's stuck on the stairs or upstairs. Well, we did a we did a quick save and we have a hard save and we have all manner of whatever. Excellent. Let's go ahead and save there. blind. I see you in there. Hey, get back here, you little bitch. dealt with so what I'm saying like there's a lot of combat it even even tells you in the freaking objectives look at this look at this destroy all the insect bees you will never see an objective like that in Thief 2 because they're like oh yeah we're making a stealth game what's with all these combat oriented uh, everything you know you gotta keep in mind you know the games that were out around this time are like Quake and stuff like that it, it's sort of understandable why they were like well I don't know Can we, is it just sneaking is that it is that all there is but uh, still yeah. I think it's definitely to the to the detriment. To, okay, extra healing potion, very nice. What is a tree but a tower that withers and dies? What is a pond but oh we we read that one. Yeah, we read that one too. Little nuggets of wisdom from the hammers here. Did we go in there? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think in the, either of the two other Thief games there's ever a, a requirement to kill anyone or anything. In fact, you typically are asked not to kill people, especially, or kill anything, especially at higher difficulties. I mean, I guess not zombies and stuff, but it doesn't really count. I don't know where he is. Don't want to go down there yet. It's going to be spooky. And let's check this out. It's going to listen ahead real quick. You know, let's make a hard save. Uh, cemetery. Because we did go out to the cemetery. Nothing in there that we need or can use. So, no, no 
not going to worry about it. Thief one is. I don't think it can ever be understated how weird Thief one ends up being most of the time. Where the hell? Oh my god! There we go. Fuck you. they would prefer we use in this level. It's a mystery, guys. No clue. None of the... There's, there's no indication. There's no hint of anything. I mean, I think we're just gonna have to guess. Ooh, I'm glad I spotted that. Bread for the journey ahead. That I did not intend for that to rhyme. Uh, we're gonna go upstairs and loot everything that we didn't from before. Once again, I mean, here's the other thing: you will never find yourself in Thief Two. Just ooh, didn't even see that one before. You'll never find yourself in Thief Two. Just willy nilly running at full tilt on tile floors ever. And you know, quite honestly, in this game. Sorry, I just I thought I heard uh, the distant sounds of a spider making whatever that stupid noise is that they make. Oh, it, it's not a stupid noise. I actually like it. I think it's very cool. I, I'm just uh, it's a bit of a frustrating. No, it's not frustrating. What am I talking about? You know what? It's happening. I'm too focused on the game, and I don't actually know what what words are coming out of my freaking mouth. Um, no, it's just a weird noise. I'm just like, okay, it's a giant spider. It makes all these like hissing noises. That's all right. But then again, you know, much like the, the movie Them with the giant ants, I don't really know what a giant ant would sound like, so I guess it's just as plausible as anything else. Plus, that sound is super iconic. If you guys don't want to know what I'm talking about, find a way to purchase, or whatever, just purchase, uh, the movie Them, 1954, I want to say? I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that year. It is in the 50s, though. I think it's early 50s as well. Excellent movie. Oddly enough, if you like the movie Aliens, uh, them is almost a sort of like spiritual successor to that movie. I mean, James Cameron borrowed so much imagery, and even like the general way the plot works out in many scenes. Um, and it was, you know, it's not ripping it off, but it's clearly like an homage. I'm sure, you know, given the type of movies he makes and everything, I'm sure it was a favorite of his when he was a kid, you know. Much like uh, The Thing, which is another sort of classic from that time period. Um, you know, John Carpenter loved that movie, and then he just actually made the, you know, he did the remake. So, yeah, check out the movie Them. Excellent movie. It's a little campy and cheesy, but what I like is that even though the, the ants, they look good for the time, and, and they can be sort of menacing, but it, it is a little cheesy. Um, 
the way that, especially the beginning of the movie is done, is actually like a horror film. It's like a real horror film, where it's like sort of creepy. And, um... And, uh, there's a lot of tension and stuff like that, so I really appreciate that, you know. It, it, it didn't necessarily have to turn out like that. I've noticed sometimes, too, in Thief Gold, the, the lean buttons get a little stuck sometimes. They don't always want to cooperate. Let's check in this. Okay, so that's caved in, so we know we can't fully explore everything down there, except I think we are going to get down there through the, through the altar in the church area. I'm going to go look around first before I start making all that noise on the tile floor. Make sure there's no other praying mantis people or whatever. And did I complete that objective? No, I didn't, so... Let's grab some more flash bombs. I think I am just gonna go nuts with flash bombs once I have, it, have to start fighting. I should have made a dedicated key at some point for it. Although I've only used it a handful of times, so maybe not. But, uh, at least in this mission, depending on how crazy it gets downstairs when we actually have to, like, face the rest of the horde that has invaded this place. Um, and there's no loot, so I'm, either there's gonna be loot further on down, or they're just gonna give us a set amount of loot, or just a set loadout for the last level, which I wouldn't really be into. The way is shut. Which reminds me, I'd, I'd love to rewatch Lord of the Rings. And you know what? I've, I only saw. No, I, I think I did end up seeing all extended editions. My buddy, he was a huge fanatic for Lord of the Rings, and uh, we watched those piecemeal. We tried to do a marathon one day, but it was like, I feel like we were like 10 hours in, and we were like, I, I can't do this anymore. You know, we got most of the way or finished two towers, and then we started. Yeah, we started Return of the King in about, I don't know, a quarter of the way in. He was just like, dude, I have to sleep. And I was like, yeah, me too. I'm dying here. Weird how they changed the, the switches in this one. Okay, so we have seen everything there is to see down here. I think now we need to stop dicking around and we need to get down there. We know where we're supposed to go now. Oh, I didn't check this area. Or the kitchen yet. I don't think there's been a single piece of loot yet. Nope. That cannot bode well for either what remains of this level, or uh, what we're going to be expected to perform with in the next level. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's get let's get her done. I'm. I don't know if I'm going to start playing the final mission right after this. I may take a break. Uh, we have some dinner. Um, it's the weekend for me. It's Friday. I did want to go pick up some beer, potentially. But we'll see. I don't know. And remember this part, too. get some sniping practice here. Nothing to grab over here. Secret keeper tunnels. Or not keepers, these are the hammers. Okay, where is he coming from? I think that's his loop. 
Nice. Yeah, see, the AI pathing gets a little fucked up. And I, you know, I'm not saying this never happened when I played Thief before, but then again, like I said, I'm not, I don't play a lot of the Dark Project. save here. We're going to say maze for tamales. And, uh... Nice. We're getting into some traditional thief stuff here so I can... Oh, you know what? I think they are rat people, and I think there are rat people in, um... Thief Deadly Shadows. There are rat people, I think. And then there's a curse shock as well, which don't really make an appearance in this game, but they're heavily implied because uh, the Lost City is like a Cthulhu city, you know? I don't think he has anything I need. Deftly done, deftly, deftly. Oh no, the healing font is down. Or is that holy water? I can't tell if it's holy water or healing. Okay, so I'm just backtracking to make sure. Yeah, okay, there was another route this way. We don't want to miss anything here. I also like the little touches, like Garrett is. Like with the sword, well, it, I haven't noticed it as much in this one. That could be one of the things that Constantine's sword does because it looks a little darker than the normal sword. Maybe it's painted black, so maybe it conceals better in the dark. Um, maybe that's one of the things. I'll have to look it up, actually. But the fact that you're actually more concealed with just the blackjack. And then if I get arrows, let's see. So this, and then... Well, it's not doing it right now, but I'm sure you guys have seen throughout the playthrough that in certain low-light conditions, um, Garrett's, uh, when, he's, when he has the bow equipped, he's more visible versus when he has the blackjack equipped. And then, of course, you move faster with just the blackjack. I think you move relatively fast with the bow, too, but um, it, it's harder to stay concealed with the bow versus like you know the best thing to run around with is the blackjack sort of encouraging you to use the blackjack Should be good. Okay. Let's see if we can take this one out too.
Whatever, I got your number. Don't worry, buddy. I got your number, buddy. go back up this way and see if we missed any loot or anything but I haven't seen once again I haven't seen any loot so far I wonder if the keeper or the keepers I wonder if the hammers just give us a bunch of uh, gold or something later and just say like yeah it's gonna suck later so you know here's a bunch of stuff or maybe they just give me a bunch of stuff for free I don't know what a wonderful sound you've discovered okay this is where I was Chisel. Guess I'm gonna need that chisel at some point. I wonder if this has been redesigned because I don't re I don't remember this at all. I remember bits and pieces like this, but I don't remember like that huge cavern we're about to go into. I don't remember that at all. So we'll see. I have no clue. Don't know. I don't know what we're walking into here. Spider's still fucking running. Damn it. Never mind, that was not what I wanted. Wait a minute. Did I not take out these spiders yet? No, we made a quick save before going down here. I think we'll just try and snipe everybody. We have enough arrows. Like I said, I get the distinct impression that's what the game wants. I'm gonna go hide because they may be coming up this way. Uh oh. Forgot I can drop a mine instead of uh, throwing it. to pay for that. Okay, so he's up here. What I'm gonna do is run away and hide like a good thief. And then I'm gonna wait for his patrol pattern to resume. I just took out the two frogs. That's worth a quick save celebration. And that mantis can do whatever the hell he wants. If he comes up here and he doesn't, you know, he wants to get backstabbed or whatever, I can arrange that. Um, do I, oh man, I'm out of fluids. Last drop of water. I'm parched. We'll, we'll go over here, save again. By the way, guys, one of the reasons I save in situations like these is because. Him out, but okay. Let's hope that this kills him. We can get the timing right. Nice! Now it's just one little frog beast. So let's go ahead and save again. I mean, this is really working out well. We'll make a hard save too. 
Uh, herd non-immunity. I would say so. They don't seem to be immune to anything that I'm dishing out today. Oh, first of all, there was a fucking door there and I didn't open it. What's wrong with me? And I didn't complete the objective, so there has to be one more insect beast at least lurking around here. Yep, need a key. Let's see what I got. There we go. <sighs> oh, sorry, yeah, I, I think I was like mid-thought a little while ago. One of the reasons I save all the time is sometimes I, it's the timing, too. Like It's like, okay, we've waited. He's, AI's probably reset its alert status. I don't want to uh, mess around with any more. <sighs> I don't want to have to wait any longer, you know what I mean? So... That's one of the reasons I do things. Sorry, I just fell off the edge there. I didn't tend to in case that wasn't clear. This is AI's going the other way this time. Damn it! You know what, you stupid frog, I don't care. I'll get more up close and personal with you if I have to, but for right now, I don't care. I think the trickster's taken over this place. Look at the trickster domain stuff down here. I gotta check the time real quick. So, oh, it's only six, okay. I may finish this up tomorrow, I'm not sure. We'll see. I mean, I know it doesn't really matter to you guys. It's not like this is a. Like I'm streaming or anything, but, um, you know, just. Yeah. I think I'm supposed to follow the blood trail. That's what I'm supposed to be doing down here. I like these water chambers. They're so cool. Mm, oh, yeah. Thank you. Isn't that cool, guys? There's a lot of this kind of stuff coming up, but... Uh, the, there's there's a lot of charm to Thief 1, and, and this... This kind of stuff is definitely one of you know Constantine's mansion. You can't really beat that level, especially the Thief Gold version. Ooh, that's a lot of mind fucking creepiness in this game. You know what I mean? Master Thief. There is scant time to explain. The trickster's foul beasts have captured our High Priest, and if we cannot retake him alive, all shall be lost. Also, our enemies hold the Builder's Chisel, which thou must recover. I think I got it already. Thy skills of stealth and treachery, and our enemies must surely kill him should we make a bold attempt. Take this Swing key on. and map and go. <laughs> Feel bad for my keeper friends, but okay, nothing in here. Let's go ahead and save. Ah! Oh! 
you stupid bitch. Okay, that doesn't work. Oh my god, dude. Well, let's... Kill me. Oh. Okay, let's load the seat. Nope. <sighs> Seriously, dude. Ugh. Just trying to like conserve a little bit of health. I mean, I guess I don't really need to because I've got like um. Come on, come get me. Showing in there doing their thing. I've got a rope arrow up there. It's my only one though, I think. So I'm gonna go ahead and save again. Crowd control, I guess. Or blessed, because I'm going after a priest. Oh, I didn't realize there was a. That was stupid. What a waste of time. Okay, well. Uh, forget the way back up. I think it's that this way? Yeah, I think it's this way. Whoop. Okay, <clears throat> we got the chisel, we've got the key to this room, and what's weird, hold on, return the high priest, build his chisel, don't kill it, destroy all the insect beasts, I don't know where the rest of them are, so that might be kind of an annoying, uh, it's probably in here. They should just be able to clip over bodies. What is this crap? I don't know why you can't clip over bodies. It actually makes it the game way harder than it needs to be. Huge 
Did you see that one overhead strike? Fuck that dude. What in the fucking fuck? did not look like it was going to. Spiders everywhere. Is that toilet? What is it? Yeah, it looks like, okay. Another toilet. Okay. Snipe this stupid spider. And where would the other fucking insect beast be? Unless I have to kill that one too. Because I only knocked him out. Okay, those guys do quite a bit of damage. I don't know what their fucking problem is. Let's see where he's going first. Okay. I thought I saw something there. Okay, alright, so we're just gonna check this top level, make sure everything's dead, everyone's dead and gone. Look at these hip boxes. Getting very sick of these. Whose head is this? Yeah, uh, the, the hip boxes being so unreliable. See, I, I don't use a lot of backstabs. In fact, it was years of playing Thief before I discovered there even were backstabs. Because I just didn't feel the need to kill anything. You know, because I, like I said, I primarily played Thief 2. So, y you need to have consistent hitboxes. Once again, it could be the updates, but it could be other things too. I feel like there's something in there. Anyways. Let's go here. You know what, let's eat because we keep getting one-shotted by everything. food for one health point. saw that so yeah see it goes from black to gray when I have my Come out. 
I haven't tried to get a headshot in a while, especially at this distance. I'm having trouble judging it. I think that should be all right. So we're just gonna run away, let this reset. Sorry, I chills out, I can knock out everyone else. There's, yeah, there's no treasure whatsoever. It's crazy. Okay, that should be enough waiting, right? It sounds like he's coming up there. Gonna chill out soon, hopefully. You didn't see anything. Oh, God damn it. know there was more than one of them in there. This is obnoxious. So again, not thrilled with this level design. Um, I guess I could have water arrowed the fires, but I th feel like that would have called significant attention. Um, yeah, I could try that. I didn't even think about that. I don't know why. You know what? I think I'm just... Like I said, you know, this is the, the general level design in this game is just not my thing as much as the Thief 2 is, and I think I'm just kind of like ready for this game to be over. Um, so I'm getting a little like impatient and frustrated with some of the general. Did you go back? I think you did, okay. So now there's this guy. Let's go ahead and save should be able to take this guy out. What the f You didn't hear anything. You didn't see anything. Oh my god. Okay. That's another thing I'm getting frustrated with. Is I'm, I'm getting a little tired of like... <laughs> see? Like, that guy shouldn't have aggroed at all. But he did. Finders, keepers, finding you. Die in the fire, bitch. I'm gonna hold on. Uh, clear path. I'm gonna I'm gonna test something. Can I headshot these assholes? Uh, okay, we're gonna load. So just a little bit closer. Something like that, I think. In the, okay. Said I haven't. I used to actually be. I used to be really good at headshots in this game because I used to kill everybody. Still? Destroy all the insect bees? Really? Okay, well, I'm just gonna save over that. That didn't seem to have upset the guys in the next room very much.
How artistic. I like how his sword can clip through the wall, but mine typically can't. I, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much, guys. How did he see me? Jesus Christ. That's what I'm saying. Like, the AI is bugged as fuck. It should not be working like this. Why wasn't he making noise with his footsteps? There's some serious uh, programming shit going on with this game. See, he's not making noise. I guarantee, yeah, he's moving. Games like this live and die by consistency of their mechanics, and uh, this game is not being very consistent right now. Let me save again, because closer to him. I see things. Watch as you do. Through the wall? This is ridiculous. I know some of you guys are thinking, like, you don't have to knock out every single one, you already cleared it out. I know, I know. See, that's what I'm saying, like, the AI is bugged, it should not have happened. I'm in his periphery, I, he can't see me straight on like that. What the f happened there? Jesus Christ. I need these game mechanics to just work for what? That's definitely probably the, I mean, I once again, guys, I don't know if it's T-Fix. I don't want to like ascribe blame where it's not due, but something is wrong with this. Okay, look at this. What what the f is this? I've never had this bad of luck before in Thief. Okay. It's just completely fucked right now. Do I have to save after every single goddamn action? See that? How did he see me? I really need to, uh, you know, I think I'm going to get it on the TTLG forms or something. i got to figure out what the hell's going on. This is really not uh, normal. You know, having to save after every single... I don't think I am gonna knock this. I don't think I am gonna knock the you know I think I'm actually gonna take a Okay. I'm gonna load again. I apparently aggroed them somehow. It 
See? Uh, I don't know if you heard that. He said, come out and fight. What is going on? The AI is completely broken right now. And I can guarantee it did not ship like this. This is not how Thief Gold is supposed to operate. There is a huge issue going on here. And I've noticed it throughout a uh, select number of missions and it seems to have something to do it could be like even just the game like what is the objective retrieve the builders chisel and hammer uh, return a high priest to the besieged hammers find the hammer high priest Can't go through that. Okay. So I missed the priest somewhere, somehow. I think I do have to take out every last one of them. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna save. We've got a couple of gas arrows. I'm just gonna make short work of these guys because I'm really tired of doing this. I'm also a little worried that because I back or I blackjacked one of the praying mantis people that that's gonna come back to haunt me if that happens guys and we've completed every other objective I think I'm just gonna use the mission skip code uh, because there's something seriously wrong I've, I've noticed it the whole playthrough and it, it seems to be getting progressively worse inconsistent AI and enemies randomly seeing you and like th things just not working right and you know, I don't know but there's definitely an issue here so we are gonna we have four gas arrows Still got two left. Here's the hammer priest. Okay, so I did need to go in here with these assholes. All right, so we're gonna make a hard save real quick. Uh, yeah. Damn, killed them all. Okay. And I'm gonna go find that one that I blackjacked, which I believe he's upstairs. Nope, that's the wrong way. We're going this way. This looks like it'd make a good escape route for me and the High Priest. He was in here. I think we're close. Yeah. He's close to here. There he is. Leave that guys. Oh my god. What silliness. Holy shit. I I couldn't backstab. I had to go back and hack him to bits with a sword. That is ridiculous. That's not just ridiculous, that's where goddamn ridiculous. I didn't even see this before. Alright, so we're just gonna I don't need to do all that. I'll just take the priest like this. We're good to go. Come on! Turn the high priest, retrieve a build of chisels. The hammer seems to think it's important. Don't kill any hammers. Okay. Yeah, we're we're almost done. We're almost done, buddy. Okay, that's the wrong one. Holy crap, that was ridiculous, guys. And had the AI been working consistently, it wouldn't have been that bad at the end there, you know. But it just it was like a nightmare, dude. And then um the insect bees. I mean, I get it. Like, yeah, immersive sim. I didn't actually kill him, but uh, give me a hint or something. Or, you know, it's got to e be an easier way to kill him too. Because I, I guarantee, with the bow, I could have sat there and filled him full of uh, arrows like a pincushion, and it wouldn't have made a difference. Or it would have, but it would have taken forever.
Okay. All right. So let's check our stats. Zero loot out of a hundred. <laughs> I guess there was loot somewhere. I didn't find it. Fifty-five or fifty minutes, fifty-five seconds. It shouldn't have taken that long, to be honest. I think that's why I don't remember much about the mission because I think um, I don't think you have to steal the. I don't think you have to find the priest or the chisel as uh, on normal, which is the only thing I've played it on. I think you just have to get to the hammers down there. So um, I don't even think you have to do the second uh, little window. You just go to the first one. Um, backstabs zero knock or knockouts fourteen. Teak. Killed bodies discovered by enemies. Okay, so we're at 16 hours 48 minutes in. Uh, I'm just curious. I'm gonna go how long to beat.com. So we're kind of on track. Actually, we're gonna be early, which is crazy because this is um, we're playing on expert. So only six, we're, we're at 17 hours. Now, here's the thing. I don't remember how long the maw is. It could very well take us three hours. I don't think it will, but I don't remember um, everything to do with the maw, uh, the, the final mission of the game. So could be another three hours, 15 minutes, something like that. I doubt it. I think it's going to be more like 90 minutes, two hours at most. So we're going to be clocking in at around 19. So yeah, how long to beat's pretty accurate. Um, so this is almost 17. Yeah, we're going to be at about 19 minutes. 18 something so we just saved about two hours I think that just has more to do with the fact that I've been playing a lot of Thief you know I can can get and get through things more easily and a uh, good chunk of the game I've played before and I, I know pretty well so um, alright guys so let's we're gonna do the um, we're gonna watch the cutscene for the next mission which which is leading up to uh, the final episode of this let's play uh so let's go watch it now and honestly escape wasn't that bad strange bedfellows obviously totally fine on expert um the only qualms i have are just there seems to be there seems to be issues with the ai now i'm gonna research into this i may actually recommend there there's such, there is a something that says ai fix but i never thought that the ai in thief gold was broken so i didn't bother installing that especially in thief 2 i've never had any problems with it i think but um, I didn't install it this time, and I think that may be the issue. Um, there may be some AI bugs that need to be worked out. So I would, I'm gonna try and do some research myself, and, and hopefully in this Let's Play, or in the description or comments or something, point this out for you guys. So if you wanna play Thief Gold yourself, you're not gonna get as frustrated as I'm getting. Again, you know, again I'm not getting frustrated because the game is too difficult. The only time I got frustrated with that was uh, Return to the Cathedral and the Haunted Cathedral. Both those levels I hate. Um, I'm getting frustrated because the consistent rules that, I'm, that I need to rely on to be able to get through parts of the mission are not working the way they're supposed to. So it's kind of driving me insane. Anyways, without th further ado, let's go ahead and continue. The weights in each pan of the balance had increased greatly, I think as of the keepers. As he approached his triumph, our foe had made himself vulnerable. We were unable to directly influence and could only watch and wait. And to see whether his pridefully chosen home would prove for his own time. Well, this is it. The Hammers say they've received word that Constantine's descended into his realm to perform a ritual with the Eye. The Hammers have built me a booby-trapped counterfeit Eye. If I can swap it for the real thing, it should cause him some trouble. If he doesn't notice me. I've never robbed a god before. It'd be a challenge. Into the Maw of Chaos, difficulty expert. The Keepers tell you that Constantine's gone into the Maw of Chaos. You get to go in after him. If you can swipe, if you can swap the fake eye the Hammerites made for the real eye he's using in the ritual, that should put a damper on his plans. The more beasts come through that portal, the more get through to the Hammer Temple and the city. The Hammers tell you that if you don't destroy the portal before Constantine finishes the ritual, it may remain open forever, even if the trickster's plan fails.
Okay, let me just check the different difficulties. Uh, okay, well, we're gonna we're gonna save at the beginning. If it, I, I wonder if this is a time constraint on the mission, which would be fucking insane. But if there is, then you know we'll keep we'll keep a backup so we can do harder and normal just to finish out the game. Uh, the, the actual what we have to do in the level shouldn't be so hard that we need to bump the difficulty down. But if this becomes an issue, this time constraint, I don't know. It could just mean that. Uh, it doesn't really matter how many people we knock out. We just yeah. so this could actually influence us to just get going. Oh my God! There's no inventory screen. Holy shit! Okay, we're gonna go ahead and save here, as always. And uh, so that's the beginning of the level uh, for the Into the Mob of Chaos, and that will that's what we'll be playing on our next episode of let's play thief gold once again thank you for joining me here thank you for watching i really appreciate uh the views i appreciate subscriptions and everything that you guys do when you're you're supporting the channel and checking me out so i hope you guys have been enjoying this let's play and um i'll be back soon with the finale thanks for watching guys